Hey everybody, 47 Mark IV here with a quick, uh, let's not say how-to video, let's say block exploration video, understanding a mechanic. So, I've got a bunch of mills on me, and if you notice, all of the mills now have progressive efficiency loss, and personally, I find the numbers confusing, so let's test the mills and understand how the math works. So I'm going to start with a pretty easy one, a dragon egg mill. So dragon egg mills say 0 to 500 GP, 0% 0 loss, and you get 500 GP from a mill. All right, so I set this on here. I look at it, 500 GP. If I put down another one, now it says right here, 500 to 1,000, 50% loss. Okay, so let's set down another egg here and see what happens. We now have 750 GP, but it says right there, 25% loss. And that doesn't quite match what this said here at 50% loss. Well, yes, it does. So if you can see, my total grid power now is 750. Each one of these has lost 25% of their efficiency. They're each outputting 375, and I'm getting... 750 instead of a thousand right so right there it's basically saying you've lost half of one extra mil so another way to think about this is this guy's 500 i've lost half of this mil it's now 250 and there's my 50 percent so if that math works out then the next one should only add uh let's see 75 percent loss so one quarter gain so I should only get 125 GP. So let's add it. That'll mean it'll come up to 875. And there it is right there. So that's how the math works. And even though it says 42% efficiency loss, well, sure, that's right. Because now each one's only making 291 and two thirds, where it should be making 500. And the math between those is 42%. So that, I guess that makes more sense to me. Now, the next question I have around this is, does this apply across different kinds of grid power? Uh, so let's go over here and let's look at water mills. Water mills are four GP a piece and it says zero to 64, no loss. So I should be able to put a bunch of these down and you know, uh, let's go ahead and let's set some source blocks here. Right, source blocks of water right there. So I'm getting 16 out of this because they're four per side. So I should only be able to put down four without losing anything, right? Uh, let's see, source block there, source block here and here. So there we go. Now I've got all of this GP and it says nothing about efficiency loss. I put down another one and you know, let's get it up to full power here. So source block there, 7% loss and it is supposed to be a one-third loss. So if that makes sense, then I've lost a third of 16, and what's that, just over five, and so I'm getting 11 out of this one, maybe. And let's make the math really clear. Let's get rid of these guys, right? So I just got these mills now. So I should have 64 plus 11-ish, uh, yeah, so right there, 74 and two-thirds. Okay, so each one has now lost 7%. So I guess the learning here is that each one of these will continue to add with diminishing returns, and depending on what band it's in is how much that mill is going to be diminished. So for the next, uh, I've already got six down, for the next two more mills, they're each going to lose a third. All right, and that makes sense. So that lost a third, that lost a third, and my total efficiency loss is now 16% uh, each. Right, so let's go ahead and power these guys up. And then if I move up to the next level, uh, I'm gonna lose half of each mill, they'll each only be worth eight. So let's see if that's true. I got 106 and two thirds, so I should come up to, uh, let's see, plus eight, so 114 and two thirds. Right, right here, and we'll make sure it's got a water block. 
and 114 and two thirds. So now the next question is, do they interact, right? So let's set back down our Dragon Mill. I'm losing efficiency here, so Dragon Mill plus 114.67 should be 6.14.67, and there it is. And then adding this one should add another 250 to it, because I'm going to lose half, right? Isn't that what it said? Lose half, yes. Uh, so that's going to make it. 864 and there it is and that is how progressive losses on efficiency work for grid power so yeah you could add more and more dragon mills but you know you can see it here let's uh let's throw a bunch down here as i continue to do this there's 864 all right so i got a little bit on that one there's 989 there's a thousand fourteen uh-oh because now I'm down in this bottom category above 1500. They're each only worth 5% of the original value. So each one's only worth uh, 25, right? So I should get uh, 1039. Yep, just like that. So I just wanted to uh, take a look at that, run through it, understand it a little bit better, and put it out there. Maybe it's helpful to you guys. So I'm 47 Mark IV, and I hope this was helpful. Uh, if it was, you know, hey, drop me a like or a comment. I always look forward to seeing those. And then I will catch you in the next video.